Well, that's the view through the Italian ship's binoculars of this migrant vessel. We believe it's holding about 200, maybe 250 migrants on board. And uh, the seas are fairly calm, but as you can see, it's bobbing around quite a little bit. It's absolutely stuffed full with people. I think one of them's just waving there. Well, this is the view right now through the binoculars of the Italian Navy frigate, the Bergamini, and you can see that boat with migrants on board looking a little into the sun, so it's a bit tricky to see, but there's 270 of them on board, mostly from Syria, they tell us. 18 children, we believe, 53 women, and they've now all been given life jackets by the crew of the Bergamini. You can see in the background there another Italian Navy frigate and several naval dinghies around it and they're just loading off from the migrant vessel I think the first child and he is now safely on board. Up here on the bridge of the Bergamini the uh, captain and the other officers are um, monitoring this operation. It's very delicate indeed. All those people have got life vests on at the moment but if they were to fall in, then they would be um, clearly at risk, and that's why there are so many dinghies out there trying to help them out. That's the scene aboard the Ibrahim right now. You'll see that the majority of the 270 people taken on board that ship, we believe on the African coast, perhaps a couple of days ago, have now been taken off by those Italian launches that you see. And it's only a, a couple of dozen men left, and one by one they're being taken away by those launches. I'm just going to take the camera off the binoculars there. That is the scene from the bridge of the Italian frigate, the Bergamini. Over there, the Italian frigate to which all of these migrants are being taken, women and children first, and uh, now, as I say, the men. But this operation going smoothly, it's taking hours, and... It'll be at least another hour before everybody is off safely.